T'Challa, you, you have to come help us. It's an emergency. What is it, SpongeBob? Uh, we, we ordered new black paint just like you said, Mr. T'Challa, sir, and, and, and now we have to count it. But, but SpongeBob, I already taught you how to count. Yeah, but I put Patrick in charge and he doesn't remember anything. Oh, it's okay, SpongeBob. Sometimes it takes a while to learn how to count. I have an idea for how we might help him. Where is the little starfish? Oh, this is so great. Here, he's around the back here. Follow me. <sighs> Patrick, that, uh, that is a lot of paint. Uh, I know, right? So, can you help me count it, Mr. Uh, what's his name, SpongeBob? It's T'Challa. Gesundheit. No, no, Patrick, his name is T'Challa. I will help you count it, Patrick. And I know a way that it might stick into your memory a little better. Wow, I have a memory? That's exciting. <laughs> of course it is. Now, Let's get working on counting these cans of paint. SpongeBob? Oh, um, I actually have to go back into the store. Um, if nobody's there when customers show up, Mr. Krabs is going to be very upset. I didn't see Mr. Krabs. Are you sure he's still around? Oh, well, uh, Mr. Krabs Jr. did go back into the ocean for a while, but he, uh... He left mini Mr. Krabs Jr. in charge. <laughs> uh, so, uh, so mini Mr. Krabs Jr. and I will be in the store, and, and you and Patrick have to count all these paint cans. Well, what say you, Patrick? Are we up to the task? Well, most of the paint cans are down on the ground, but I guess I could throw them up in the air if you wanted. Uh, no, Patrick. That was just an expression. Thank you, SpongeBob. I'll take it from here. <laughs> Have fun! And make sure you get the exact right number of cans, because Mr. Krabs wants to know how much money he's going to make. Okay, Patrick. Here's what we'll do. You bring a can of paint over to me here, and I'll bring you the number that shows you how many cans of paint we have so far. Got it? Uh, I bring you a can of numbers, and you tell me how many paints we have so far? Uh, you bring me a can, I tell you the number. You, I... Are we doing numbers or letters? Uh, just start rolling them over here, Patrick. Oh, okay. There you go. Perfect, Patrick. We now have one can of paint. Whoa. Is that how you spell one? Um, no. This is how you write one. You write numbers using numerals. You can spell them using letters, but we should save that for another time. Let's keep counting. Okay. Here comes another can. Now, Patrick, we have two cans. One, two. Hey, this is pretty fun. I'm going to get another one. We'll even make them all nice and neat. Excellent, Patrick. One, two, three. Now we have three cans of paint. Oh, this is fun. How many do we have now? We had one. Two, three, now we have 
four cans of paint. <laughs> now we have five cans of paint. Ooh, this is great. Now we have six cans of paint. I think I finally figured this counting thing out. Um, Patrick, who are you talking to? Uh, nobody, I guess. Okay, should I bring some more? Uh, yes, Patrick, we have to count the entire pile you have there, so keep bringing them. I'll keep them all gone. Okay, here's another. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now we have seven cans of paint. Oh, <laughs> this is great. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now we have eight cans of paint. <laughs> that one kind of looks like a jellyfish wearing a jellyfish as a hat. <laughs> if that helps you remember, Patrick, good for you. Keep bringing us more paint. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now we have nine cans of paint. Whoopee! This is great! Every time we put a can of paint, we get a brand new number. Now, how many do we have? One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Are you ready for this, Patrick? Oh boy, am I ever. we got so many different shapes. I'm going to be so excited to see which one comes next. Ten. We have ten cans of paint. Hey, wait a minute. I've seen this before. You said this was number one. Aha, good, Patrick. You do have a memory. But the way numbers work is that after we get a full group of ten, we go to the beginning of the numbers again and start reusing them. Well, these don't look like a group. Oh, you're right, Patrick. Here, help me put them all in a stack. Wow, that's a lot of paint. Oof. That's right, Patrick. This is ten cans all in one group. So, we have one group, which is why we use the one again. And we don't have any cans that are outside the group, so the one is next to a zero. That's where we get the number 10. So now that we have a whole group, does that mean we're done counting? No, Patrick. Bring me another can. There you go. Perfect. Now I have one whole group, and I have one extra. I don't need the zero, because I have a group of 10, and a group of one. What do you think this number is, Patrick? Uh, the spooky eyeball number? <laughs> no, Patrick. This is number 11, which is how many cans of paint we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. <gasps> wow. And we could keep going? 
Why don't you bring over another can of paint and we'll see? <laughs> now what? Well, Patrick, did our group of ten change? Uh, nope. So we keep the group of ten, but instead of one extra, now we have two extra. One, two extra, and ten to start with. This number is ten to extra. Uh, no, Patrick. This number is twelve. Who? Oh, this is a little confusing. Don't worry, Patrick. It will start to get easier. Bring me the next con. Okay. There you go. Okay. I have my group of ten, and then I have eleven, twelve. Thirteen! Wow. Hey, where'd the paint go? Oh, it must have rolled back towards you. <laughs> Wait a minute. I don't remember how many thirteen is. Well, Patrick, do you remember how many this group is? It's, uh... uh hmm. Wait. The first one is one, the next one is two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, uh, this one's called ten, but I forgot how to write it. Very good, Patrick. You need a one because you have a whole group. And a zero because you have no cans left over outside the group. Oh, yeah. And then, when I take my ten and add one, then my number becomes... Eleven! Yeah! And if I add two, then my number becomes twelve. That's right, Patrick. And then three, my number becomes thirteen. Keep going. When I add 4 to my group of 10, my number becomes 12. Uh, what does my number become? We haven't seen this one yet. Ah, this is where it gets easy, Patrick. Now, you look at the number on the end, and because we have a group of 10 with it, it's that many teen. So, 10 plus 4 is going to be 14. 14. Wow. What if I put 5 there? Well, then we don't have 4 extra. We have 5 to go with our group of 10. So what number would that be? That would be 15. Oh, I may have told you that trick a bit early, Patrick. This number is actually called 15. Okay. How many now? We have a group of 10 plus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Six extra. This is sixteen. <laughs> Hooray! Now how many? This is seventeen. <laughs> how about now? Eighteen. <laughs> 
19. Oh no, I just remembered something. What did you remember, Patrick? After nine, then everything has to repeat again. That's right. It's a pattern. It helps make it easy to count. What do you think's going to repeat? Uh, well, first we have to repeat building a giant tower. Very good, Patrick. And I have an idea. Let's put the giant tower on this plank here so it doesn't fall over again. Ooh, that's a good idea. Here we go. Um, Patrick, what happened to all the lids? Uh, well, if you just smash them down real good, they kind of disappear. I'm not sure that's a good idea, Patrick. Oh, you want me to unsmush them? Well, maybe later. But for now, let's look at what we have. How many groups of ten do you see? Uh, there's one, two. Two groups of ten. Perfect. So I need the numeral two to be in the front. How many extra cans do we have not in part of a group? Uh, I don't see any. That's right, Patrick. So if I have two groups of ten with none left over, this number is 20. <gasps> wow. Would you like to switch jobs, Patrick? I'll roll the paint to you, and you tell me what number we have. But I don't know how to get all fancy with your number names. Actually, it's very easy. Let's start together. Twenty jars with one extra is... Twenty-one. That looks familiar. It even sounds familiar. That's right. Bring me another. Twenty jars plus two extra is 22. Hey, I think I could get the hang of this. You bring me some jars. 20 3. Very good, Patrick. How about now? Twenty four. Twenty four. Excellent work. Twenty five. Yes, Patrick, you're getting it. Twenty six. Twenty six. Wonderful. Twenty seven. We'll be counting up a storm in no time, Patrick. Twenty. Jellyfish hat. Oh, that's not the real name of that. Are you sure? Because I'd really like a jellyfish hat. No, Patrick. It's actually called eight. Oh, well then this is twenty-eight. Exactly, Patrick. Now it's twenty nine. Yes, Patrick, you've got it. And then 
time to put a group together. Oh boy. But Patrick... Uh... Yes, T'Challa? Um, I was going to tell you not to smash the lids together this time, but apparently it's too late. Oh, sorry. Now I have three groups of ten. Ten, twenty, and I'll need a three. And there's no extra. What number did we make now? This number is 30. Oh, 30. I love it. And this can be 30. One. That's right, Patrick. This is 32. Excellent work. Thirty-three. Wonderful. Thirty-four. Yes. Thirty-five. Keep going, Patrick. Thirty. Six? Yes. Thirty... Seven? Yes. Thirty... Eight? Are you sure that's not thirty jellyfish hat? <laughs> it sure could be. I think it looks like a jellyfish wearing a jellyfish for a hat. Y yes, you told me that already. Oh. Okay. Back to counting. Thirty-nine. Yes. And smash them all together! Meant to tell you not to do that. Oopsies. Okay. Here's ten, twenty, thirty, forty. Where did I put my four? Hmm. Okay, we could keep doing this for hours. Um, actually, Patrick, I wanted to talk to you about that. <gasps> Do you have to go save the universe? Uh, no, no, the universe is fine. But we still have a lot of cans left to count. Like a lot. And you're tired of counting? Oh, I love counting, Patrick. But in order to get the right number fast, we can count with a super sneaky shortcut and finish sooner. Then once we have the right number, we can go back and count again if we want. Oh boy, that's great. Um, but before we learn your super sneaky method, uh, can I have them deliver the rest of the paint? The what? Yeah, well, they wanted to deliver all the paint at once, but I told them they'd have to come back later because I had to count it first. You mean you have more paint than all that? Yeah. Uh, hang on just a sec. Let me go find that truck driver. Mr. Truck Driver! Oh, wait. Patrick! Ugh. Well, I hope that little starfish knows what he's doing.
Okay, the delivery truck is on its way. Oh, excellent work, Patrick. Hi, I'm here from Phantom's own paint delivery service. I'm here to deliver all your paint. Um, thank you. Can I ask, just how much paint is there? Oh, I don't know. You'd have to ask the boss. Is he a fan of horror stories? Is that why this is called Phantom's own paint? Oh, no. He's an actual phantom. Top of the day to you. Well, that is unexpected. All right, well, let's ask him. Well, actually, I've got to unload it first. Um, Patrick? Yeah, T'Challa? I have a bad feeling about this.